Hello everyone, this is Adele Channel 21 and today I'm going to show you how to play Battlefield 5 on unsupported NVIDIA drivers or even unsupported GPUs. Even though you do need DirectX 11.1 to run Battlefield 5, uh, cards like the Fermi generation don't get the latest drivers even though they are capable of running Battlefield 5. But either EA or NVIDIA has chosen just not to support it. In any case, this is what happens when you run, uh, when you have, uh, when you do nothing, and you should get a nice error message which prevents you from launching the game. There we go. Detected driver 391, required is 399.7. Well, there's a very old trick with which you can uh, circumvent this issue, and it still works on Battlefield 5 as well. I'm going to show you now um, just to verify that I am running old cards. Here you have the wonderful GeForce experience. You can see I'm running two GTX 570s and what we're going to do is go to your uh, destination where you have installed Windows, go to Windows go to your system32 folder and search for nv where you will find the file nvapi64.dll and what this file does I'm not exactly sure I believe it contains some information about uh, what version of the driver you're running but um, not certain in any case what I do know is that this trick works. What you're going to want to be doing is rename this file to something else so that it is not detected anymore. You're then going to want to be opening Battlefield 5 and as soon as Battlefield 5 opens a window you're going to rename it back. So I'll demonstrate it right now. It's going to rename it to something nice like screw you nvidia.dll Yes, we want to change it. So we're going to open Battlefield 5, change this back. Yes, this opened. And hopefully, there we go. Battlefield 5 is running. See if we can make this a bit larger without upsetting OBS. Oh, that's very loud. See if we can fix that. There we go, much better. And here we are, Battlefield 5 running on a GTX 570. Usually it runs quite a bit smoother than this, but since I'm recording it is messing with my performance a bit. Uh, just as a demonstration, just hop into some multiplayer. And it's absolutely baloney that NVIDIA has decided that no, you can't need the 399 drivers, why wouldn't you? If you have old drivers or an old card which doesn't get the new drivers, you just gotta buy a new one. Even just this is just an open beta. But oh well, at least it's very easy to circumvent this issue and even though you won't get the best performance on a Fermi card, maybe you have something like a modern card which is running all drivers. We have a bit of stutter here but as I said it's usually a bit less when I'm not recording. This is maxing out my 2600k. But we are on the map, um, I'm not sure how it's called. And we're in a snowstorm. Be nice. Well, I hope this gets the. Uh, I hope this uh, this might help you if you have an older card or you're just running an older driver and you don't want to update to the latest driver. You don't have to. With this one easy trick, you can too be playing Battlefield 5. Well, again, I hope this was helpful. If it did, uh, like we much appreciate it. And. Um, maybe for a next video. Bye bye.